Hey guys, Professor Prime here at MyJapan.com, and today we are unboxing. Well, I don't know what we're unboxing. It is from Show Z Store. I ordered it, so I'm pretty sure I know what it is. So let's go ahead and let's crack it open, shall we? It's uh, Transformers Rise of the Beast Scourge, guys. This is from Black Mamba. This is a KO of the Studio Series. Let's see, it looks like I kind of scratched the box when I was... So this is my first impression. Now, here's the thing, I I never got the Studio Series version, Hasbro. I gotta get my, I gotta get my Rise of the Beast. I gotta get my Scourge, it's my last Terracon that I needed. Let's get her out of the box here. Oh, she looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. It looks, it looks, it's a studio series version of the character. So I, uh, just right out of the box. This, this, this is super loose. That is super loose for this one's super tight. And it was in, in like, I could probably like tighten it up. I don't know if it's a pin. Oh yeah, it's a screw pin. So it's not not terrible and then the accessories it comes with it comes with this blaster which i don't know if the studio series comes with this i don't think it does so that's a nice little addition and then it comes with his sword which if i think about this right folds out first impressions guys this is this is obviously a ko this is i don't know i don't know how well this i think this is within scale i think this is a scale joints feel good from you know i mean this is i think the paint applications are about the same it's also half the price so this was originally 55 dollars. this ko is was like 25 dollars. so it's like half the price like this plastic feels really feels really like i don't know how you call it, it feels really like flimsy i mean i'll probably transform him a couple times we'll I'll definitely have a transformation video on the channel and stuff like that but other than that i like it's it's really it just came out of the cold right now too so yeah and the finger articulation it's got a hand and then we've got claw hand here which opens up and this is like a rubber again i don't have the studio series version neither does mr j neither one of us got got it so i i can't i can't do a comparison unfortunately let's see does it have oh it does have waist swivel and head so yeah guys i mean it looks it feels great it feels good other than a couple like the smoke sex feel like they're kind of cheaply made look at the transformation i like that these are rubber i don't know if the studio series version was rubber it looks like there might be some extra pink deco on it i don't know oh my god i mean it's literally a, it's literally a one for one from the studio series so it's not an upscale version or anything like that so i can't imagine it being you know there's i don't think there was any improvements made on this i think it was just literally like a one for one translation which for some people you might be like hey Hey, no, don't don't do that, you know. But here's the thing: I never received it in store. It was always sold out on Hasbro Pulse. If I ever see it on Hasbro Pulse for a decent price, I'll still pick up the official one. But right now, this is what I got. Overall, guys, it's a great figure. It's gonna go well with my terror with my collection. Anyways, I'm not I'm not a fan of buying KOs. I, I try to get the official versions of you know either third party or official as much as possible. But in this case, I really need I really want it. Scourge it became available, so I was like, you know what? I've never seen it in store it's always sold out online i'm not paying the over ridiculous aftermath after sale prices so that's what i had to do guys so you know thank you guys for watching in this uh, unboxing video of disaster oh no disaster that's what he's called it's called disaster yeah looks good guys thanks for watching and as always if you enjoyed this video check out this one right here and as always till next time